hello beautiful guys welcome back to my youtube channel animal realm so today topic is so interesting because it's about the exolotl the scientifically known as amphibistoma mexicum is a unique amphibian that has captivated the interest of scientists and enthusiasts alike originating from the ancient lakes of Xochimilco and Chaloco in Mexico. This is extraordinary creature has evolved to exhibit a range of fascinating characteristics and adaptations. So in this video we will delve into the anatomy, physiology, behavior, ecology and conservation status of exolotl, shedding light on its remarkable place in the nature world. Anatomy and morphology so exolotl is renowned for its Newtonic characteristic meaning it's retain its larval feature into adulthood. This includes external gills which resemble feathery tufts and the streamlined body with a long flat tail. Their limbs are relatively short and slender where four digits on the front limbs and five on the hind limbs. The skin of exolotl is smooth and soft, typically ranging in color from light brown to dark gray with some individual exhibiting patches of albino or melanistic pigmentation. One of the most striking features of exolotl is its regenerative abilities. It has remarkable cap uh, capacity to regenerate lost or damaged body parts, including limbs, tail, spinal cord, and even parts of its brain. The ability become the exolotl available model organism for regenerative medicine research, offering insight into pot potential treatment for human injuries and diseases. Habitat and distribution So historically, exolotls were found in the ancient lake of Xochimilco and Chaloco in central Mexico. These lakes were once parts of a vast network of west wetlands and waterways, providing a rich and diverse habitat for exolotl and other aquatic species. However, due to the urbanization, pollution, and the introduction of invasive species, the natural habitat of exolotl has been significantly degraded. Today, the exolotl is considered critical in danger in a wild with population declining rapidly. Efforts are underway to conserve the remaining population and restore their natural habitat, but the challenges are significant. Ecology and behavior of exolotl are primarily nocturnal and are most active during night when they hunt for food. There are carnivores feeding on diet of small fish, insects, worms, and other aquatic creatures. In captivity, exolotl can feed on diet of blood worms, earthworms, brine shrimp, and commercial exotic pellets. Exolotl are solitary creatures and are generally peaceful towards each other. However, they can exhibit cannibalistic behavior, especially towards smaller individuals or those with injuries. It is important to prove to provide adequate space and hiding spot in aquariums to prevent aggression, reproduction, and life cycle. Exolotl reach a sexual maturity at around 18 to 2 years of age during the breeding season, which typically occurs in spring. Male exolotl deposit a packet of sperm known as spermatophores on the substrate. Female exolotl then pick up these spermatophores and use them to fertilize their egg. Exolotl are capable of laying hundreds of in a single clutch which are typically attached to aquatic plants or other surface. The eggs are hatched after about 10 to 14 days and the larvae emerge resembling miniature versions of adults. The larvae undergoes metamorphosis over the next few months, eventually losing their gills and developing lungs to become terrestrial adults. However, in captivity, exolot can keep in the larvae from indefinite through proper care and management. Conservation efforts so exotic is currently listed a critical endangered on IUCN Red List of Threatened Species. The main threat to exotic include habitat loss and degradation, population pollution, introduction of invasive species, and or explosion for pet trade and scientific research. So thank you guys for watching the video and stay tuned for another beautiful video.